Sean. I'm back with another video, and uh, I'm about to react to Naruto Unhinged episode two. I had actually watched episode one a while, a while back ago, and that shit was funny as shit, bro. Like, the AI voices that they had for the characters was funny. Um, Naruto, Kakashi, I think he's probably the funniest one. This nigga is hilarious. Naruto's my second favorite when it comes to the AI voice acting, because that nigga, I could always say he's a real nigga in my eyes. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, yeah, I kind of wanted to do a reaction to these, because the first episode was hilarious, and yeah, we're going to get into episode two. Naruto un Unhinged, Kakashi stand on business. All right, let's go. Without further ado, let's get to the video. I do not own Naruto. I do not own Naruto or any other series related to it. This video is a parody for entertainment purposes and for the enjoyment of fans that follow the original series. So with all that said, please enjoy the video. Episode two, Kakashi stands on business. Running squad deep with a play Naruto. Damn it, he's trying to outshine me in front of the hoes. The hoes are gonna love that trick I just did. I need to find Sasuke before it's too late. Yo. I don't think I can go another minute without worshipping him as Relax. my savior. I ain't gonna lie, Why is he just standing there? Down bad. I'm actually over She's here. Already down bad in huh? original, but Zesty this style. Version, they just Remember Jutsu. What the fuck am I looking at right now? Down. Her reality Thank God that shit was fake. I thought my glorious king was gay for a second. No, that shit was real. The kiss wasn't fake. The kiss wasn't fake. It would seem that the zesty style jutsu real is a weakness tactics. for her. Or better yet, her glorious king is her actual weakness. Yeah. Damn it, how the fuck is he so nonchalant? Especially in front of the hose. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I don't like being outshined in front of the hose. But you hey, use some impressive tactics to impress them. Be like I actually be have like one more thing I need to do in front of them to boost my ego. Fuck. What is he about to do? I'd hate to do this to him in front of the hose, but this should teach him to be a little more humble. Oh, shit, I lost him. You hear that? Because that's the hose laughing at you. Damn, Damn. it. Not Sasuke but anyways, laughed at by the hose. I'm gonna go see this what Naruto is hose. doing. That's crazy. So do me a favor and keep making the hose laugh while I'm gone. You black spirit chucker piece of shit! This nigga Naruto still hanging from the tree, bro. That's crazy. I can't even listen with both AirPods because my left one fell out my ear. Hey Siri, pause my music. What is that? That lame ass albino nigga should have known not to leave not fresh food out of the in the AirPods, bro. So it's not my fault if my natural nigga instincts start getting active? <laughs> this is a weird ass food combination. This should be a felony because this nigga really bought some beef lo mein and some fucking jollof rice. Fuck it though. Both of these things are mad good, so I don't really care. Thanks for the free food, bitch ass nigga. Real nigga <laughs> tactics, rule four. Never leave your food out around untrustworthy niggas. There's no way you just back, quoted though. that book. Don't ever leave your food out. Especially when you got a roommate. Niggas will eat that shit. Who is this beautiful angel staring at me? Wait. Oh, the embodiment of my reason to live. I missed you so much. Don't ever do that again. Why won't he fucking love me? Because you're fucking weird, bitch. It's okay, my love. I know you have a hard time expressing like your feelings about me. Look at you know what? <laughs> my pride is already broken because of Kakashi. I'm not dealing with your yeah, bullshit Yeah, you have the whole laughing at you. That's crazy. And please stop all this dick riding. Nigga, what the fuck do you mean we don't pass? Naruto, 
You spent so much time saying the N-word and trying to prove to me that you're black. Hey, man. That you forgot the whole nigga. purpose Stop of this training him. exercise. And as for you, Sasuke, you were too focused on impressing the hoes. But instead of impressing them, you made yourself look like a clown in front of every single one of them. That fucking That's dickhead. Tough. Yeah, you can't. I was about to say, you can't let her disrespect her like that, but never mind. Can you stop talking about my glorious king like that? Oh, and then there's the Sasuke Dick Riding Hall of Fame member. Yes. The most Get useless on the team who didn't even throw a single punch. Yes. You were more upset about Sasuke possibly being gay than of him being in critical Talk condition. To her, nigga. But at least that's some good news for you, right, little buddy? Even after you embarrassed yourself today, one of the hoes still wants you. I mean, Fuck that's you, just, that's just, that's just How am I considered one of the hoes when I'm only loyal to Sasuke? Why is he cooking my nigga Sasuke like this? Yeah, that is crazy. But anyways, I'm over this shit. If you three can't figure out how to work as a team before I get back, your ninja career is over. Ten minutes later. I can't do this anymore! My balls itch like crazy, but I have no way to scratch them! Hmm? It's like someone threw itching powder on them. I'll scratch them what? for you. That's the realest nigga thing I've ever heard. Sasuke, what are you doing? That looks gay. I don't care. Okay, bitch, I, have I have nothing else to lose except my edge streak. Kakashi this destroyed nigga my and his edge streak. And plus, he wants to see us work as a team, right? So as far as I'm concerned, I'm just helping out my fellow comrade. I'm never gonna forget that he did this for me. Damn it, now I have to do it since my messiah did it. Looks like they're finally I ain't gonna lie, to I was not talking it. like, fuck your food. Are you I don't really want help too? Yes, Naruto. Just hurry up and tell me which one to scratch. Well, what? actually, the one I need you to scratch is extra itchy. So I need you to squeeze it a little like this. Yeah. Hell no! You weren't useful at all earlier, so at least try and help out now. <laughs> You're lucky my glorious king said something. Yo. Because I would have thrown some icy hot on your balls. That's a cool story. Now go ahead and start squeezing. What the fuck, bro? What the hell are you three doing? You know what? I've seen enough from you three. I'm ending it here. Nigga, wait! They were just helping me scratch my balls because you had me tied up! Yo. I already know that. That's why you three pass. Hey. Huh? What the fuck? fuck? What? There are two types of people in this world. There are people who willingly do inappropriately gay things in public. And there are also people who choose not to do inappropriately gay things in public to help someone out. For example, there might be a scenario where you have to suck a dick to save someone's life. But anyways, those who willingly do inappropriately gay things in public are scum. But those who choose not to do inappropriately gay things in public to help someone out are even worse than scum. Yo, what the fuck so are this nigga talking about? Mm. He's actually pretty based. Nah. <laughs> Man, that's the realest shit a nigga like me has ever heard in his life before. Nah. Hey. That's gonna do it for that. <laughs> Yo, this, this little mini uh, bridge series is fucking hilarious. I'm not gonna lie. But, uh. Yeah, I'll catch y'all in another episode. All right, y'all. Peace out.